Good afternoon. I am out on Central Avenue looking down onto the golf course just behind 15 Green. Most of you have seen this picket fence. We've got a project coming up in two weeks and that's going to involve replacing some of the damaged sections of the picket fence, including the six by sixes. So two six by sixes are split. Those will be pulled and replaced. The fence will be replaced where needed and we'll try to reuse as much of the fence as possible with the idea that we would extend the fence down our property line. So from our side of the fence, you can see the six by six is cracked. The attachment for the gate is compromised, which allows the gate to sag, makes the connection point between the two pieces of gate tight and where it binds. This is a pretty large section of gate. So we'll look at splitting the difference, possibly making the entrance gate a little bigger, the main gate a little smaller, which allows it to carry the load a little easier. We'll replace some of the picket fences or some of the picket pieces that are damaged. We'll strip and repaint this. This allows us to save a bit of money on the fence so that we can replace the entire section. So if you notice the homeowner has added a cedar section that doesn't match. So from this point on, we'll probably go with just a stock standard cedar fence with no lattice, paint it green and extend the fence all the way along the property line. You can see in this section, the homeowners made a fence to try to keep animals out. It looks like he's pruned back the hedge so that you'd have enough room to put a wire mesh fence in. So we'll give that another prune and we'll actually install the fence starting at the brick wall and make it one continuous fence, one continuous style, one continuous color all the way along to this point and then return back to the picket fence. So this is a project we anticipate starting just before or during the course closure March 18th. Thank you.